Welcome to a new video. Last week was rocky. Didn't like it. It was really bad. Today we have a new movie. I didn't pick out of the cup just because I'm downstairs. I need to watch a movie. I put one on the list. Put one at random. We got the notebook. I've not seen it all the way through properly. I have seen bits and bobs. Don't really know how it ends. Don't know the full story. I'm honest. I can't remember it that well. But I remember it was decent. The bits I've seen. I know it's Ryan Gosling, Rachel McAdams, and I'm looking forward to actually watching it properly. It's just beginning now. Let's go. Notebook, here we come. Mm. So far, good, good, good movie. Loving the characters. It's all going well. I like it. This is sad now. Don't leave each other. And I'm so happy that you're doing it. Oh. You got so much ahead. Well, that's sad. That's very sad. You wrote a letter every day for a year, and it just. That's it. <laughs> Damn, man. Damn. So. I don't know who this dude is, but I'm assuming she is Ali. And then. I mean, he's called Duck. Duck? Duke, so I don't have a clue what Duke is, but I'm I'm guessing Duke is actually this guy. Uh, what's his name again? Uh, Noah. I'm assuming Noah is Duke, and he's not actually reading; he's just remembering, which would be really nice. But I feel like I might just ruin it for myself by working it out. Either way, loving the movie. I feel like this. I mean, I feel like it's gonna be a good ending, but I feel like it's gonna be kind of sad as well at some point. I'm expecting this to be a sad bit soon. But realistically, I'm assuming it's just lead the husband. So that was the weirdest thing I've ever seen. Not the movie. I just realised that um, Lon, the uh, fiancé, is uh, Teddy from Westworld. Which is insane. That's crazy. I didn't even realise it until just then. I feel sorry for him now. <laughs> I like that character now. <laughs> but yeah. Still a great movie. Um, the next time you probably see me is after I've finished it. Because it's very nearly over. Damn. This is a sad movie. What the hell is this? Damn, man. What? This is meant to be a happy movie. This is meant to be a good movie. So I finished it. That was a good movie. That was a very good movie. Um, I didn't expect it to be that good. I liked how simple it was and straightforward, and it was just it didn't waste any time. It was just one nice simple plot. There wasn't too much, you know. It didn't. Uh, have too much detail, it was nice and simple to follow, and it just made a nice, simple, very good, well told story. Um, it's sad though, the ending is sad, man. Like, just in general, the fact that she forgets, but specifically when you see it, it's so sad, especially the part where um, she's like, Come on, let's go away, let's take, take a drive anywhere you want, let's go for a drive. And he's like, Not tonight, darling. And she's like, Come on, wait, why did you call me darling? Sorry, who are you? That was sad. That was really sad. Um, but in general, the characters, very enjoyable. You know, the main two, Noah and Ali. Great characters. Even the older versions are very well done. Um, the When the family comes to visit, great scene. Even the, the uh, backstory, the reasons why they do stuff, you know, the motives. It's all very well, very well told. It's perfected. It's not a ten out of ten, but in many ways it is perfected in, in in a different scenario, not in terms of ratings, but in just terms of the execution is on point. Is what I'm trying to say. I can't think of any faults at all. And I feel I just yeah I just think it was a very good movie. 
It's a movie I can definitely agree with being on the best 100 of all time. Um, it's probably, I mean, I'm not a huge fan of romances, you know. La La Land's decent, even if that is a romance, it's not really a musical. Um, I like Before We Go, I do like Before We Go, and About Time. But this is probably out there, this is probably like, probably the best one, honestly. Um, and yeah, great movie. I like it a lot, I do. Uh, Ryan Gosling's a great actor, Rachel McAdams a great actress. And yeah, I can't think of any faults. I'm going to give it an 8.6 out of 10. Puts it in ninth, and yeah, we have one last thing to do. Everything I thought I should do. Um, a lot of great scenes in it, a lot of great moments. You know, the swans and boat scene, perfect. The uh, fairground scene is really good. It's also very funny. I thought I should just give it a little bit more credit. But yeah, thank you for watching, guys. I'd be Johnny's. See you next time. Bye.